Okay, welcome to part three of our GUI dictionary uh, lesson. Uh, in this one, we're going to actually uh, add some functionality to our program. Now, what we have so far is we've got a label, we've got a text entry widget, we've got a list box, and a button. If I click the button, nothing happens. Okay, so, let's uh, get it so that we can actually display some stuff and get some things going here. Close that. Okay, so basically, what we want to do um, is the first thing. You know, outside of the function, once the program starts running, we want it to actually uh, have some data. So I'm going to create a dictionary. I'm going to call it albums because that's kind of what we're looking at here. So we have an artist and the album. So albums equals, I'm going to use those uh, curly braces. So that creates a blank dictionary. So now I'm going to add some test data. Later, you know, you're supposed to add, uh, or you could add, uh, you know, loading the data from an external file. But for now, we're just add some test data. So I'm going to do albums. I'm going to put three albums in. And dun, 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 dun. so I'm going to do Bob Mold and Black Sheets of Rain. I'll just abbreviate because I'm a little bit lazy. The Smiths. He is murder. And and the cure disintegration. Okay, so, um, so now I've created the data. What I need to do is I need to display that data in the list box when I click the show all button. So the show all button is already set up. So when I click it, the command is show all, and it goes up to this function. Okay, so it's very, very simple. Um, first thing I need to do is I need to iterate through here. So I want Bob Mold, the Smiths, the Cure. Okay, so if I, with a dictionary, if I iterate, so I can go for artist in albums. Okay, so I'm just gonna put a little comment there so we know what it does. So iterate through the keys and add to the list box. So for artist in album, so for each artist, I wanna add it to the list box. Okay, now here's the code to do that. So LB music, because that is the name of our list box. Okay. We use the insert method, and we want to put it at the end, and I want to put the artist there. So at the wherever the end of the list box is, it's going to add the artist. So let's try that. Let's run the terminal. Okay, so I'm going to hit show all. You see the cure, Bob Mole, Smith. Notice the order is different because that is how uh, uh, dictionaries work. So they're not necessarily in order like, like they are in a list. So you can see that's working. Now if I hit show all again, it keeps adding them to the end. Okay, we don't we really don't want that. Okay, so I'm gonna fix that. So what we need to do first is clear the list box. So again, it's LB music, because that's the name of our list box. I'm going to delete from the zeroth character, so that's the very first character from zero to the end. Again, if you're using Python 3, uh, this will be a little bit different, but you can look that up. Okay, so let's try it one more time. So now it's going to delete what's there. There's nothing there now. So now if I click it again, because it's deleting it, then adding it, it only appears one time. That's pretty much it. Um, dictionaries, again, this is no different than if you were doing a non-GUI program. We created an empty dictionary, we added some test data, and then we we have our button show all, which calls the function show all, and we clear the list box, which is here, and then for each artist and albums, because that's our key, okay, instead of printing like we would over here in the terminal, we just insert it at the end and the artist. Okay. Next lesson, we'll learn how to actually show, you know, click here and then have the album information appear here.